Hey, I'm Mayor Blake Massengill here for our Mayor's Monthly Chat. And today, I'm with our Fuquay Arena Police Department School Resource Officers, also known as SROs. Now is an exciting time in our community with school starting back. Not only do these SROs keep our kids safe, but they're heavily involved in their schools. Officer Baker and Officer Decker here with me today. Officer Baker, why did you choose to be a school resource officer? I chose to be a school resource officer because growing up my dad was a youth pastor and after aging out I became his number one go-to chaperone and I've always enjoyed working with youth so I gave it a try. You know, growing up in high school I had a hard time making you know the best decisions sometimes and I feel like between that age group of 13 and 18 we always don't make the best decisions so I feel I had key mentors to help guide me and propel me to be a successful person in life and I feel like it's only fair to do the same for these kids. Our school resource officers number one job is to keep our kids safe in schools but there's a lot more to it than just that they build relationships. Tell us a little bit how you build trust and relationships with students. At the beginning of the school year there was a group of kids that were skeptical and didn't trust me at first. I approached them and opened up to them and showed them that I'm just like them this is just a uniform and a badge. So by the end of the school year, they opened up to me. They were approaching me, hanging out with me at lunch. I also got to join a bunch of students in multiple gym classes and played sports with them there as well. We'll sit down with them during lunch. We'll talk to them about what they enjoy doing. Um, we'll go into the gym, we'll play sports games. Sometimes I'll go and do dance performances with them. They know I'm a terrible dancer, but um, that's okay because it shows that I am human. I'm not a robot and uh, it makes me more approachable. We all have fond memories of high school. What are some life lessons that y'all can remember learning in high school? If I could go back now, I'd probably say pay attention more in class because I never thought it would affect me the way it does now and I'm in school more than I ever thought I would be after high school. I would just recommend just be yourself. Um, when, you're, when you are yourself, you'll surround yourself with the right people and uh, it'll just make you happier in the long run. The cafeteria is a great time for an informal time to build relationships. Speaking of that, what's your favorite food to eat here in the cafeteria? Uh, this past school year it was probably cheese pizza from Domino's. I would say pepperoni pizza will go again, but we had pizza all year. Pineapple and ham, that's my favorite. <laughs> Not just anybody can be a school resource officer. It takes lots of training. Can you tell us about some of the specialized training that you had? So there's a 40 hour required school resource officer training. There's crisis intervention and de-escalation tactics and a juvenile law class. We've had a lot of fun with our SROs today. We'll also be adding a new SRO to Southern Wake Academy this fall. And remember, their number one job is to keep our students safe and build relationships. I want to wish everybody a happy upcoming school year.